We also realized as part of this that it wasn't just working together, it was the leader of those agents that needed to change. We realized that when we turned this employee on day one, that our sales leader had a completely new employee. Someone that had been trained, they'd gone through onboarding because we trained this agent in our internal systems. So they had a new employee that wasn't truly green, but that was still going to make mistakes. So this agent was now an employee of our sales leader, and that sales leader had to correct that digital agent. They had to log into Salesforce, make corrections to understand what this individual, this agent was doing in the sales process, understand what needed to be tweaked, and then know who to go to to make those tweaks. Because this agent inside of our environment had the metrics that they needed to live up to. They had the goals that they needed to hit. They had the ability to be autonomous, but because of that, they were gonna make mistakes. And this leader hadn't really paid attention to, oh, this is a completely new employee that I'm gonna have to spend time during my week to manage. Digital agents and agent force agents inside of Salesforce are something you have to pay attention to. Do you have a leader identified in your business as the person that's going to take that responsibility on?